Good morning, everyone. Just a really quick tip. What, what I do is on my commute into work, I usually leave the house at around 4.30 and I get here at or just before five in the morning, right? And on the way to the office, I'll record a voice memo on my phone. I take this voice memo, and I don't know how I usually get it onto my computer, but um, grab the voice memo and throw it into Google Drive because I refuse to use Apple's iCloud because you keep asking me for money, and I'm not gonna give you any more money, dude. Anyway, I'll throw it into Drive. I'll go into Microsoft Word, and I will uh, hit this dictate here and transcribe. Now, I'll upload the audio, and it'll Upload that audio, it'll transcribe it. And for whatever reason, Microsoft Word, the desktop version of it, it doesn't have this feature. So if I open up Word, so here I've opened up the, um, the desktop version. If I hit dictate, there's no transcribe here. I don't understand. Maybe it's not meant for me to understand. Anyway, okay, so it took all of what I said here and it made a transcription. So I'll add it to document, just text. And then I'll grab this this big block of text, copy it. Then I'll head over to ChatGPT, paste it, shift, enter, enter. Please summarize everything I said into bullet points. Actually, you know what? There's certain things that I said in there that might actually already be kind of like prompts. Let's just see what it does. There you go. Okay, here's a breakdown of your process. This is what I talked about. Record a voice memo on your commute, transcribe the memo into text, paste the text into the ChatGPT for organization, use ChatGPT to summarize into bullet points, refer back to the organized thoughts as needed. Consider setting up the camera in the office for a voiceover if it fits your schedule and adds. <laughs> See, there you go. Thank you, ChatGPT, I really appreciate that. This is a very, very small example of what I do, but there will be times where I, I will be driving to work, you know, and I'll have some sort of an idea and I will just start to word vomit into a microphone. This is what I use, really. Maybe that's my thumbnail right there. I'll have a voice memo transcribed into text and it's just a huge, huge block of text with a bunch of random thoughts in it. Cause my brain kind of goes all over the place. I do have some sort of like a little nugget of an idea. I know that there's something there. And I know my YouTube channel is just starting up and stuff and, and I'm not quite in my groove quite yet. By the way, subscribe to my channel, please. But it's been helping me a ton to be able to, even though my brain thinks so chaotically, I could still take those thoughts and have ChatGPT help me to organize them in a certain way where I can actually use information that I just spit out. Because for me, organizing, it's, it's one of the most difficult things to do. Like to take an idea or a concept or when I'm learning something or working, to be able to properly organize it, it's difficult. This is the first time where I have personally seen the power of ChatGPT to be able to actually practically help me out instead of like saying, explain quantum mechanics to me like I'm eight years old like that there's no use for me to know what quantum mechanics is so it's like chat GPT is such a powerful tool but up until this specific way of using it I haven't really been able to figure out a practical way of using it other than like asking it certain questions hoping to God that it it's correct because a lot of times it's wrong in this situation though I don't see how it could be wrong because I'm giving it all of the data so I don't see how it would pull, unless it took something that I said and just completely replaced it with something else. Plus, I think the most important part of it is that in, in those longer text blocks that I put into it, a lot of times it will omit something that I said. Just because it's trying to be more efficient, I guess, I'll just type in like, oh, I actually remember talking about this. And then it'll be like, oh yeah, here, and then it'll bring up the entire thought that I had in a really structured way. It's just an interesting method that I've been using recently over the past, I don't know, maybe a couple weeks. And uh, it's been a really, really cool and fun way to organize things. Anyway, I hope that helps. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next video.